Hey there Fukushima Truthers, it's um, Andrew Biss here, how you doing? Just wanted to make a short video, hopefully, about um, something that's quite serious. Um, uh, another Fukushima Truther uh, called uh, Connecting Dots 2 is threatening to uh, file copyright infringement on, on Fukushima Beach unless I uh, remove and ask all people to remove on Fukushima Beach uh, one from or YouTube or video platforms. Now um, I'm going to say a polite no uh, to his request because he sent me a message. Uh, so connecting dots to uh, he, he um, talks about uh, Fukushima and gold and you know constitutional things, which is great. Uh, if you've had a good experience with him, that's great. Uh, more power to you. Um, so connecting dots two or someone claiming to be connecting dots two. Uh, sent me this message. Um, I'm filing copyright infringement against you for Fukushima Beach video. You used part of my video without asking, nor did you give me credit, nor did you, did you give me credit, and you've turned on me and sided with the corrupt YouTubers. And that was the last straw. Uh, because I, I participated in Kevin Blanche's um, uh, yellow and black protest, just by the mere act of uh, uh, joining in. Uh, with him making a video, uh, supposedly siding with him. So I'm not turning on anybody, just uh, trying to get the truth out there. Uh, please remove Fukushima on the beach and re inform others to remove it as I'll be coming, uh, coming after them, after copies of it on YouTube. And uh, a follow-up message. Um, okay. Just remove the video, I'll file an infringement, it's your choice. Don't forget to have other copies removed, as I'll be searching to make sure Fukushima Beach isn't on YouTube, Vimeo, or in any other public source, and learn to research what YouTubers you promote. So, um, you know, <laughs> it's, it's unbelievable, it's just unbelievable. Just, I uh, don't have words, because uh, what happened was, I made uh, on Fukushima Beach, and if I used any source, I you know tried very hard, very very hard to uh, credit everyone I could. And uh, what happened with um, connecting dots two material was that it was mixed up in a, in a video made by someone called Little Jimmy ninety five. And uh, I wasn't able to keep track of uh, all the material in there. And uh, I credited Little Jimmy ninety five, and connecting dots two sent me a message saying, oh you know. Uh, you didn't credit me, uh, what's going on? So I said, oh, oh. I made a, a video publicly apologizing to Connecting Dots 2, saying I'm very sorry, and uh, your contribution was uh, very, very good. It was about a minute and a half um, where he's videoing uh, some material from the Norwegian Air Institute, and um, uh, yeah, I don't know if he got permission from them <laughs> to uh, use their material, but that's what's called fair use, isn't it? Uh, fair use applies to everyone, and that's why uh, people can post things on YouTube and in the media as fair use. Uh, so why does it not apply to me? Why does it apply to you using the Norwegian Air Institute material? You know, the radiation map, the Nor Norwegian Institute um, uh, uh, displayed. So I apologized to him, and uh, in the subsequent um, uh, versions of on Fukushima Beach, I included connecting dots to in the uh, in the credits. Thanked him on the credits. Now that one that thanked the version that thanked him on the credits is the one that was spread by Red Button Studio, by Miss Milky the Clown, uh, Nibiru Magic, uh, and. Um, a channel called Subscription TV, which uh, that's got about um, oh, you know seventy thousand views. They all have connecting dots to uh, accredited on them. So that's about ninety five percent of people who have seen on Fiction Beach uh, have have connecting dots to credited on there. Ninety five percent. And uh, so yeah, I I apologize to connecting dots too. I said I'm sorry. You know, I was, um, you know, I was I was working very hard to put it together, and um, and yeah, so I yeah said apologize. 
So he messaged me back saying, well, okay, um, uh, do you mind if I post on Fiction Beach on my channel? And I said, yeah, sure, go ahead. And he also posted my postscript to On Fiction Beach, uh, where I was, you know, praising his contribution. And he, he said that, oh, look at this Andrew Biss guy. He, he, uh, he praised me, um, my, my channel and my material, because he was sort of showcasing that uh, he, his, his channel has merit to some of his detractors, which is great. You know, he's, that's, that's what he wants to do. So he posted uh, On Fiction Beach, and the on Fukushima, on Fukushima Beach postscript, and I, I think he's taken them down subsequently, which you, know, you can. It's up to you. But um, yeah, so I would take that as being, you know, permission, a, apology accepted, because he's he's uh, he's um, posted on Fukushima Beach himself and the 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 postscript as well. Now. So it's like saying, um, okay, I'll, I'll invite you over for a dinner party. And so you come over for dinner at my house. And then I see you the next day and I see you're talking to someone I don't like, like Kevin Blanche, for example. Uh, imagine I didn't like Kevin Blanche. And um, I say, well, I don't like that you're associating with Kevin Blanche. Um, I'm going to charge you with criminal trespass for, and stealing, my, uh, stealing food from my kitchen because you ate my food. You know, it's like, you know, it's like um, committing a crime in the past that didn't really, that wasn't a crime. Uh, you, um, I, I don't see how you can post on Fukushima Beach uh, on your channel and, you know, say this guy has merit, i.e. myself, and then turn around and say, oh, you violated a, a copyright uh, you infringe copyright because, you know, I apologized. Uh, Connecting Dots 2 uh, accepted that because he, you know, he posted the video, his own version of the movie, and, um, and posted the, po the postscript video as well. So, I mean, what kind of universe can someone... Um, say that uh, I don't like who you're associating with please remove this video a video that you have posted before I mean it's, it's like uh, like no I don't like what you, you know I don't like what who you're seeing me saying to another adult I don't like who you're who you're hanging out with or who you're protesting with uh, do as I say or I'll uh, I'll um, make infringement on your video so uh, it's called free will, connecting dots to it's called uh, free association. Uh, I credited you on every subsequent copy of On Fukushima Beach, of which 95% has credit to you for the content that you had on there. It was an honest mistake. I apologize. Do you want me to, to apologize again? And, uh, you know, up until now, you have accepted my apology. And because uh, I'm associating with people like um, Christina Consolo and uh, James Horak, you know, I'm just talking to these people, getting their ideas. It's free association again. And Kevin Blanche participating in his yellow and black protest. It's the last straw and you want to file the infringement on me uh, for uh, something that um, uh, you consented to. Uh, over a year ago, so you know you you post uh, connecting dots to you post a lot about uh, YouTube censoring my videos. Uh, I, I suspect you your videos are have a pro constitution uh, bend on them. So where's the free association? Where's the where's the merit in censoring videos? Um, I just I just don't get it. Okay, so. Uh, how, how will it help the Fukushima truth movement and all truth movements where where something is censored because uh, you've turned around and said, oh, no, now I've, I don't give consent anymore. And you posted on Fukushima Beach on your channel. Okay, so there's no, I apologize, and there's, there's 
there's not a violation. So uh, polite no, I'm not going to remove on Fukushima Beach. Do what you will. Uh, I may post a um, subsequent version uh, without your contribution, but I'm not going to um, remove what I currently have uh, I have up there. And uh, just perhaps question your own motives and um, uh, for uh, engaging in censorship, threatening censorship, and try, trying to tell people what to do and, and run their lives. Um, again, you know, I invite you over for dinner. Okay, yeah, we have dinner. And then the next day you, you talk to someone I don't like, I say, okay, tried you with trespass for last night. That's, you know, it's not going to hold up anywhere. So, um, you know, file all the infringements you want. You know, could be serious. And, you know, I, it's just on principle, the whole thing's ridiculous. So, um, I, I'm not going to call you Co-Intel Pro because, you know, I don't think you're Co-Intel Pro at all. And it's just a really overused uh, word on YouTube, especially with with truth issues and stuff, but, um, you know, it's, uh, it's just not on. So all the best to you and uh, keep posting your truth, but uh, I think you're wrong in this situation. And I want all people who have, um, who have seen and or posted on Fukushima Beach to hold tight. If you get messages from anyone telling you to remove uh, on Fukushima Beach or associated videos, I'd encourage you just to, to tell them a polite no. And um, just wanted to let you know the whole story behind this because um, uh, connecting dots too, uh, love him or like him, love him or hate him, um, I don't really hate him at all. Um, yeah, I think he's wrong here. And um, yeah, that's all I have to say. So um don't want to deal with this a lot uh, because there's a lot of um, people who are actually trying to uh, get the word out on the street and uh, connect knots too if you have uh, if you're leading people in spreading the truth you know you're getting out there and making videos and more power to you and uh, if you're holding protest events awareness events let me know because uh, I want to support you but um, Kevin Blanche is doing them uh, Lonnie Clark uh, I'm trying to get out there I've been out there a little bit um, so uh, that's what I'm, we should be focusing on. And for you to have time to try to shoot down every, on Fukushima Beach video on YouTube, um, seems like you're um, perhaps uh, not distributing your time wisely or uh, effectively if uh, truth in Fukushima is your, is your real passion. Okay, so that's just my take on that. So all the best to you and um, Let's get the truth out there, guys. Take care. Bye.